It is my honor to present our current research paper entitled Syntrophin Beta-1 Candidate as a New Marker for Colorectal Cancer Metastasis in the International Research Award on Oncology and Cancer Research under the category of Best Research Award. Colorectal cancer, or CRC in abbreviation, is one of the most common cancers and the third leading cause of cancer-related death worldwide. Thus, an understanding of collector carcinogenesis process is essential for the recent studies in molecular uh, classification of this cancer. Of all alterations in cancer cell, gene expression studies are of great importance outcomes as a cancer biomarkers and therapeutic targets. Metastasis happens in advanced stage of cancer. Metastasis is a complex process leading cancer cells spread from the primary tumor site and then colonize and grow in a secondary organ within a patient's body. Noticeably, five years, the survival rate of CRC stage 4 decreases to 10% compared to the stage 1, that is about 90%. Thus, it is crucial to find a suitable marker for CRC advanced stages. In this study, we found the value of SNTB1 gene in CRC patients throughout a comprehensive data analysis. To the best of our knowledge, the present study is the first report on the SNTB1 gene expression in colorectal cancer. SNTB1 is a member of the syntropin gene family and is located on chromosome 8. The, pro pro the protein encoded by this gene is a peripheral membrane protein. Cancer biomarkers may measure the risk of cancer development and progression in a specific tissue. In the current study, we aim to find the value of the SNTB1 gene as a marker for CRC metastasis through a comprehensive data analysis and a systems biology approaches. Then we examined clinical, clinically the SNTB1 gene expression in 78 colorectal tumors and tumor-adjacent normal tissues. First of all, we obtained five array-based datasets from the GO database. Then we classified all samples into two groups consist of metastatic and normal phenotype of CRC tissues. Using oligo and lima packages in our software, all datasets were analyzed to assess a set of common differential express genes in metastatic CRC samples. We also used two microRNA expression datasets to assess a, a set of differentially expressed macroRNAs in a CRC metastatic phenotype compared to the normal sample. In addition, we found differential expressed transcription factors using the previous gene expression datasets. Finally, we found differential expressed genes, differential expressed transcription factors, and differentially expressed macroRNAs in CRC metastatic phenotype. Then we used experimentally evidence-based algorithms to construct a gene regulator network according, according to the uh, regulatory elements and their target genes. Uh, integrating all the data, we constructed a gene uh, regulator network using Cytoscape software then we use a SentiScape plugin to find the most central nodes according to the node degree and node betweenness algorithms in the depicted gene regulator network. Based on the mentioned methods, we selected some genes as candidate molecular markers for a colorectal cancer metastasis. Then we used a JPL database to analyze the gene expression. JPI is a web-based tool which uh, provides access to a large number of data, including more than 9,000 tumors and more than 8,000 normal samples. Okay, up to now, 
our analysis showed SNTP1 gene is closely associated with a CRC metastasis. For further analysis, we experimentally examined SNTP1 gene expression in 78 CRC patients by real-time QRT-PCR. According to our data analysis, we found a list of uh, three, uh, 378 78, uh, common differential expressed genes in a CRC metastatic phenotype. In this heat map, you can find upregulated genes above the graph and downregulated genes beneath them. The gene regulator network analysis showed 11 differential expressed transcription factors and 9 differentially expressed microRNAs as the most important regulator factors that affect on more than 50% of all genes. Interestingly, we found that most of these regulator factors affect SNTP1 gene. In this figure, 20 possible regulators consist of transcription factors and microRNAs which effect on the expression level of SNTP1 gene are indicated. Some of these factors, such as LEF1, LEF WT1, uh, or uh, FOXA1, have been reported as important factors in CRC progression. Uh, results acquired from the GPA database showed SNTB1 is overexpressed in colorectal cancer compared to the normal samples. In, ad in addition, uh, we found the overexpression of SNTB1 gene is associated with a patient's disease free survival. We also uh, used real time QRT PCR for further investigation. The results showed that SNTB1 mRNA was increased with uh, 3.55 uh, fold in CRC tumors compared to the normal tissues. Our study also indicated a significant, a significant associated between the overexpression of the SNTB1 gene uh, with a tumor stage 4 and cancer metastasis. Uh, here, a rock curve analysis is shown, and uh, the figure uh, shows that the uh, area under curve, or IUC, for a CRC metastasis uh, was uh, calculated uh, 0 0.77. That indicated a moderate usefulness of SNTB1 mRNA expre expression as a marker for uh, the pro prognosis of a CRC metastasis. Our study depicted the most important differentially expressed genes and some of the regulator factors in a CRC metastasis. In this study, we depicted a gene regulator network to highlight the importance of some gene regulators. Further analysis of the gene regulatory network showed SNTB1 might be as a, one of the most important genes. Our results revealed, revealed some uh, potential uh, regulators for SNTB1 in uh, CRC metastasis and highlighted a uh, possible regulatory mechanism of this gene. Interestingly, uh, we found the overexpression of SNTB1 mRNA in CRC and its value as a candidate for the pro uh, prognosis of patients with uh, advanced stages of uh, colorectal cancer. Uh, in the present study, we introduced the value of SNTB1 in uh, colorectal cancer for the first time but more clinical experiments need to be conducted to uh, decipher the role of this gene in cancer development and progression. Uh, this paper was published in the Journal of Gene Reports and is available in ScienceDirect website. Thank you very much for your attention.